The National Science Week underscores how innovation can drive job creation, industrial growth, and national self-reliance. The five-day event is on the theme, Made in Uganda, Innovation to Market. So we wanted to organize this event to bring science to the public. Uh, there will be scientists discussing, but in a language which is understandable by other people. So we want you to, we want the public to understand what we are talking about. The things that you see at the exhibition, they have a source, they have an origin. Embracing Uganda-made products is to bridge the gap between the research lab and the marketplace and hope to further advance Uganda's bold journey of turning innovation into market trading solutions. We also organized this summit because we want to, to talk to the public, really. Uh, the public sometimes sees science as uh, eh? something complex, but especially for the young people. I want the young people, the students, to have enthusiasm for science, but not just the traditional science they have been taught which does not seem to relate to their lives. I want when a child in senior four or senior two goes into class and they teach him balance this equation. They, they have something they relate it to that in the future I'll be manufacturing a drug. Innovators have turned up in large numbers showcasing a wide variety of innovative products, each designed to create employment opportunities and solve societal problems. Years back, we introduced Pombegadi anti-hangover as a new innovation. So after introducing the innovation to Ugandans, many Ugandans came up and liked the innovation. Now, we've been, all along, we've been developing the product to get it ready to the market. Right now, as we speak, we've gone through several scientific studies for Pombegad anti-hangover. We are in energy storage. Uh, energy is required in all spheres of life. You as a human being, you need food to have energy and the power to do certain activities. But these other uh, uh, utilities, or that we use in their life also need energy. In the 2025-2026 financial year, Government of Uganda allocated 60.26 billion to the science, technology and innovation sector. Nalusibawini, reporting for UBC.